Hey, hello everyone and welcome you all to learn, know and grow the world's best loving platform as you already know that here you get the latest tech updates so welcome and thank you for coming here and in this video I am mean, going to giving the details and I also say that I try to resolve your most relevant queries from topic on which topic today we are going to discuss so today's topic is Huawei H-U-A-W-A-I This is a new P50 Pro smartphone which is going to launch Harmony operating system So in this video we are going to talk about that what is this what is this smartphone which can very more details today I am going to give related this and what kind of features in this phone ok is this phone is good to take to purchase and to use or not this thing also will know in this video and why we are unable to reach to 5g this topic is also related with this phone also so you have to listen this very carefully okay what are the design features of who are we okay so and what what is the operating system issue in this phone you should know also because after listening this this news means this information about operating system you will you will be able to judge to take decision that we should purchase or not okay and the next one is older android replacement how harmony operating system is going to replace something this thing also will know here okay so let's before going to start this video i will i can i can I can request to you that you can subscribe this channel, like this channel if you like content then you have to like, if you don't like content you don't have to like, you have to share with your friends if you like to know to your friends also ok. So let's start. Despite facing down a global chip shortage, a US export ban and plummeting market share, Huawei is still plowing ahead and announcing its next flagship smartphone Huawei 50 50 Pro I am going to the best detail in main points the first point is company's first smartphone launching with Harmony operating system second point is Huawei's in-house operating system ok means it has in-house operating it is made by in-house ok you, you, so you could understood third one is Huawei's devices are usually based on the company in-house Kirin K I R I N S O C S made by subsidiary E Silicon. Okay, the fourth one is initial version of the phones will use the 5 nm Kirin 9000 S O C. Huawei says it will switch to the Qualcomm Snapdragon 888 S O C. But wait did not the US government ban companies from exporting US origin goods to Huawei? Yes, this is also a main question you have to know. Qualcomm was guaranteed a license to sell chips to Huawei. The seventh point is Qualcomm license only cover 4G products. It never cover 5G. Okay, this is also you have to know. And which brings us to the next major oddity of the P50, it does not support 5G. So next question, the main question is, why we are unable to reach to 5G? 5G, do you want to, do you never want to purchase 5G? Do you know, never want to use 5G? Yes, you want. So let's listen this. Huawei Consumer Division CEO Richard Yu blamed the US for the limitation during the presentation saying via the official translation because of the four rounds of US restrictions over the past two years or so 5G phones are beyond our, our reach the lack of 5G is not really a big deal for consumers who rarely see any practical benefits from it but it's a big deal for the 5G obsessed smartphone manufacturers and cell carriers. Design features of Huawei. We should understand what are the design features of the. Okay, this is also main point. Huawei is filling them 
with several smaller cameras and sensors. Going for a Fox big camera look, the Pro model features a 50MP main camera, 40MP black and white camera really and a 13MP ultra wide camera in the top circle. The bottom circle gets a 64MP 3.5x telephoto with a 200x digital zoom which must make pictures look like mud and LED flash and a microphone so do you like this kind of features okay let's come on the next step next step is operating system issue now we understood these advantage features but now we are going to disadvantage okay so there is also the issue of the operating system as this is the first smartphone Huawei is launching with Harmony OS Huawei executives pitch Harmony OS as a fully in-house product and have said it is not a copy of Android okay the second point is Huawei services replacing the Google services okay the third point is Huawei has been replacing Google services forever in China where Google Play is not available and was later forced to do this internationally thanks to the export ban. Harmony of OS second is based on a newer version of Android compared to EMUI but other than that it's just a name change. So we should understand about the Android replacement also. Huawei announced a plan to update 100 older Huawei models in China. Okay, in China, from Android to Harmony operating system, a move only possible because Harmony operating system is just a newer version of Android. And the P50 press release says that more than 40 million users have taken the company up on that offer so far. In the last, I would like to tell you that besides the above, we have some pretty normal species. A 6.6 inch 120HZ 200 sorry 2700 multiply means into 1228 over LED display and 8 GB of RAM, 128GB of storage and 4360 mAh battery. In China, the phone starts at dollar 927 cny 5988 for the 128 gb version with sales beginning today there is no word on the phone being sold outside of china and with huawei is facing all sorts of supply problems it would not be surprising to hear that the availability is limited so how do you like to listen and watch these kind of updates if you like you can share subscribe you can un encourage my power because you are my power generator if you will not help then who will well any animal will not come to help me you have to help me because you are my friend thanks for coming here